Hi, I'm Nick at SideView, and this is a very quick overview video of how to use our product, Cisco CDR Reporting and Analytics, for call concurrency, gateway utilization, capacity planning, etc. So, this is an advanced topic, and please refer to our, our core UI overview video. Um, but this video is going to assume that you've played with the product a bit, and you've run some reports, and you've gotten some comfort level. We're going to talk about call concurrency and gateway utilization in the reporting side. Now, this is an example of a report that just can't really be done in the general report UI. Computing call concurrency involves actually walking through the data and tracking and counting calls, especially if we're going to split those by something. By default, this will split the calls up by gateway and compute concurrency separately per gateway. First, however, I'm going to switch this back to look at just yesterday, just because my test data has a very strange spike showing. So say I'm interested in um, some circuit usage problems that we had yesterday. This page will, by default, show you the call concurrency split out by gateway in this main chart here. You can see a normal intraday pattern here. and Everyone goes to lunch in the middle. You can change this, split this by call type instead. Let's do that. So inbound and outbound. And we can change this to device type and see hard phones, soft phones, IP communicator, Jabber devices, what have you. Notice below, all, all throughout this, it's been showing a second chart. Incoming and outgoing calls dropped because no circuit or channel was available. And it's using the same time range. So these will always be kind of mirrors of each other. So if we go back to that main split by gateway concurrency chart, We can see we did actually drop some calls yesterday. And those calls are going to correspond roughly to peaks in the time. So you have to line it up a little bit sometimes, 8.40 AM. It's not always directly underneath. And here's where we drop the call, 8.40 AM here. As of our latest version of this app, you can actually drill in to that time point. And it will now give you another call concurrency chart just from 8.40 to 8.45 AM. Sometimes this is useful. Sometimes it's just eye candy. We can also change uh, and deselect some of our gateways. If some of these really aren't subject to capacity worries, you can turn them off and then they will not appear in the chart. Also, you can change this from incoming and outgoing. You can change this to look at internal calls. Uh, you can use this therefore for more than really just gateway utilization. You can use this for internal you know, support group capacity planning. You can use this as a general concurrent calls tool. Um, and that's that's it. Um, as with basically all of our UIs, you can do uh, save and create, create a dashboard panel, create an alert, create a, have it you know make a PDF of this as a dashboard, and then email that PDF to yourself, so on and so forth. Uh, but that's it. I hope you've enjoyed this video. Thanks very much for watching. Please watch our other videos.